Nathan here for Travel Annex in Toronto, Canada. Today we're going to Centerville Amusement Park. I'm here with a few thousand kids. We're going to go see some animals, we're going to try out some food, and we're going to try out some rides. I don't know who's more excited, me or the kids. Centerville is a quaint little village across from Toronto's harbour, just a short ferry ride away. The town hall says the village was incorporated in 1867, but our sources indicated that the amusement park was created in the 1960s. Our first stop was the Far Enough Farm. Our exclusive tour got us behind the scenes with the animals, thanks to our guide, Tracy, who is one of those people who seems to get along with the animals better than most folks. I mean way better. See you next. Trying to feed. The first furry friends I'd meet were a bunch of goats, who were more interested in my fingers than interviews. Oh, yeah. Then we got to meet a baby miniature horse named Peanut, who became a very close friend. Ah! Next was a fluffy alpaca, an irritable llama, and a pig named Charlotte. Like from the book. But wasn't the spider Charlotte? Oh well, some pig. Anyone ever ridden a cow before? You can try. <laughs> Love to. Love to. Let's do it. Sadly, Tracy didn't actually let me ride Buttercup, so I had to go look for something else to ride, only to find more troubling news. So I've heard there's a height restriction, so maybe I can't ride a pony today? No, you have to be under four and a half feet for this one. Well, maybe I could lead a pony around? Could you teach me how to lead a pony? I think we could, we could do that. That sounds like we could, we could make it work. So there I was, leading ponies. Just like walking a dog. Oh, yeah, Sailor. Please. Sailor, we're trying to walk. We can't, we can't cuddle right now. <laughs> okay, come on, Sailor. My pony kept wanting to stop and eat. I know, I'm hungry too, but we gotta keep working. Which reminded me, I was starving. So we continued our tour behind the scenes to see how the people of Centerville prepare their local delicacies. I wanna do it. I, I wanna do it. Funnel cake. So you start in the middle, and just go around like this, okay, keep going. Oh, faster, faster. Buckling under pressure, the Centerville chefs guided me through the delicate operation. I still think I did a pretty good job. Hands! Next, my funnel cake was off to be coated with every kind of fruit topping under the sun, as well as a ton of powdered sugar and a mountain of soft serve ice cream. Now it was time to overdose on sugar and get on some rides. Let's get on the haunted barrel ride. The sign says it's pretty scary. We'll see. It says to keep arms and legs inside, but that spider looks awfully cuddly. You must remain seated, mommy. Terror death, Frankenstein! Pirate, we got some graffiti here. Ah, oh, gross. All right, let's take this performance machine for a ride. Oh, <laughs> we're off. Nice day for a ride. The antique car ride was exhilarating, but I had to slow down for a minute to offer assistance to some pedestrians. Hey ladies, need a lift somewhere? There's room for both of you. All right, have yourself a good day. Turns out they were fine, but I was off to the log fume anyway. We're going for it. I'm gonna lose my hat. Hat secured. <laughs> Not so bad, not so bad. Still got some cotton candy. <sighs> Next, we are off to Centerville Railroad Station. Hit a ride with Abu, the coolest conductor in town. Far enough farm. I went there. I'll ring the bell. And you can eat some cotton candy if you'd like. From the little train, you could get a tour of oh. all Centerville's attractions. Oh, yeah. Get it in ya. Your calories. Sorry guys, this train is out of service. That's joking. <laughs> I'm kidding. I had a great time at Centerville. This reporter is taking the carousel for one last ride. I'm Nathan reporting for Travel Annex. For more great videos on where to go, stay and eat, subscribe to Travel Annex today.